Yes, it's me, Pred. Welcome to Fallout 1, my new Let's Play series. And I decided to play this because yesterday evening I was sitting on my couch uh, looking for a Let's Play to watch. And um, normally I watch Let's Plays of games that I would never play, either because of time reasons or because they're too old or because I don't really know if I'm going to get into them. And I was looking for a Fallout 1 Let's Play and I didn't find any good ones. Either they were incomplete and they were incomplete for like two years or um, the sound quality was bad or the video quality was bad so I bet there are some gems out there who did this game and which are really good but you know YouTube always uh, favors uh, the guys with the most views and the most likes and uh, those let's plays uh, didn't really <coughs> uh, suit my needs is that an expression? I don't know so I'm going to play this half guide uh, because I don't really want to run around uh, pointless and not um, knowing what to do. So let's start a new game and we're going to create our own character and I'm going to create this after a guide um, and the name of my character is going to be the name of my favorite uh, co-host oh, okay doesn't um, fit so I'm gonna just name him Barani Barani is gonna be our protagonist and so yeah let's go through the stats so I heard that uh, later in the game you get power armor and you can do you have like 10 strength then anyway so we don't really need that much strength uh, to begin with so I'm gonna take um, a 4 in strength um, we're gonna have a 7 in perception because uh, this is pretty good uh, at the beginning of the game we're gonna have a 5 on endurance um, charisma 5 charisma because we can um, as with I guess all Fallout games you can raise these stats later on we're gonna have 7 in intelligence uh, 6 agility and luck is also gonna be 6 so I heard you need um, you need this because um, Later in the game, there's like this really awesome weapon you can only get if you have uh, uh, some amount of luck. So, I guess we have two points left. <laughs> I don't really know why, because um, in the guide, we used all, of, all the points. Strength 4, Endurance 5, Perception 7, Charisma 5, Agility 6, Luck 6, Endurance 5. So I guess we can uh, put some more points in here. Um, okay, so I'm going to put some more agility and some more luck. Why not? So let's go to the skills. Can I deactivate these? Yes, I can. So we have three skills to uh, choose from. We're going to use uh, small guns because we're going to be use, uh, we're going to be a gunslinger more or less, and we're going to have gambling because um, gambling gives us a lot of money if we have a good amount of luck, and then we could either use energy weapons or speech. <sighs> I want speech. I don't know why, but I think you know you, you will have more dialogue options and stuff like that. So let's go to the optional traits. Um, we should use gifted. Um, what does it do? You have more innate abilities than most, so you have not spent as much time honing your skills, your primary statistics are each plus one. Oh, look at that, we get plus one, that is pretty awesome. Yeah, okay, that's a must, uh, gifted. Um, what else could we use? Hmm, hmm, hmm. Let me see, bloody mess. By some strange twist of fate, people around you die violently. Hmm. 
Yeah, I'm going to put, uh, I'm going to choose Bloody Mess because I kind of like that one. It's pretty cool. So, <clears throat> Burani is pretty young. He's uh, 16. No, he's not. I'm not going to uh, give away his um, age. So he's going to be 25. You know, he's going to be like grown up, but not old. 25. And he's male, I think. I think he's male. So, yeah. Let's go into the game. We have everything, yeah. Awesome. Ha! Ah, you're here. Good. We've got a problem. A big one. The controller chip for our water purification system has given up the ghost. Can't make another one. And the process is too complicated for a workaround system. Simply put, we're running out of drinking water. No water, no vault. This is crucial to our survival. And frankly, I... I think you're the only hope we have. You need to go find us another controller chip. We estimate we have four to five months before the vault runs out of water. We need that chip. We marked your map with the location of another vault. Not a bad place to start, I think. Look, just be safe. Okay? Hey guys, so we're back. Uh, I guess we're outside of the vault now, but we're still in a cave. So let's have a look around. I have to get used to the controls a little bit. Um, okay, you search the bones. Um, we don't need another knife. Are these different. Is this a different ammo? Can we actually look at ammo? Oh yeah, we can. Okay, it's uh, 10 millimeter armor piercing ammo. What do we have here? What is JHP? Hollow point, maybe? Okay, so this, I guess, this is more for. What's that? Stim pack. So I guess this is more for like robots or something. And this is for people. Whatever. So let's equip our gun and load some ammo. How do we do that? Do we have to put it here? I guess we do. Um, is it loaded? I don't know. So the guide suggests um, that we kill all the rats here. So we're going to do that. Because I think it's crucial to our leveling process. Okay. Um, I read that you can actually... Um, uh, shoot on different parts of the enemy, but I have no clue how this works. Which is kind of dumb, I guess. Yeah, let's just shoot it, whatever. Uh. Bam! Oh, yeah, he died pretty gr bloody gr gruesomely. Uh, can we have another shot? No, we can't. So we have to wait. How do we end the turn? Space? Yes. Okay, so we're back into normal mode. Um, let's go to the next rat. Where is it? Okay, next coming. Oh, it's gonna reach us. No, it didn't. So let's kill the rat. Did I miss it? Oh, what the hell? Can I go somewhere? Yeah. Get off some 
uh, distance between me and the rat. Yeah, that's not gonna hit us. Great. And now we killed it. Stupid rat. So let's go into that corner right there and have a shot at the other rats. Did I kill it? Yes, I did. Great. Okay, it's uh, going pretty smoothly. Let's shoot that one. Oh, I'm, s I'm like a gunslinger. Pretty cool. Oh, next one. Okay, I guess the percentage is... Um, is there anything here? I don't have enough action points. My ass. No, I do. Okay, I guess it's not worth picking up anything. Um, from a dead rat. Okay, let's shoot them. I'm pretty good. I mean, I have like 45% um, success rate on my shots. As you can see, I'm by no means an expert in this game, you know, I don't know how, how the combo system, the action point system works. Well, I do, kind of, because I've played the other Fallout games, but um, by no means perfect. So does he use the ammo by itself? I think he does, or do I have to load the weapon? Maybe I do, I don't know. So let's see, oh there's another rat. Oh, we have a 49% chance, and we missed. Of course we did. So I'm just gonna walk her up. Another one bites the dust. Oh, now it's attacking us. It's not gonna reach us. Kill it! 95%. Bam! Dead. Oh, there are more rats here. Yeah, I guess it's not very exciting, you know, killing all the rats, but uh, for me it's pretty cool, cool because I get to use, um, used to the combat and everything. So I'm just gonna shoot them one by one, and I missed. Oh, I think we got, his, uh, got its attention. How many percent chance? 95. Nice. Let's walk around a bit. Oh! It's attacking me, I hope it won't reach me. No, go away, rat. Okay. I'm just slaughtering these rats. So if I press spacebar, I'll like end the round or something. Okay, let's get closer to the rats. Oh, it's coming for us. Barani, go kill the rat. Nice. Be a little bit closer. 49%. Yeah, but I'm a gunslinger, so. No chance for the rats. Um, can I hit them from here? 41%, 37. Oh. It's gonna come towards me? No, it's not. Let's try again. Nice. Let's get a little bit closer, so now it will start attacking us probably, but it won't reach us before we can kill it. 95%, come on. What? I can't shoot it from here? Oh, I'm out of ammo. What the hell? Reload. So we do have to reload, so that's good to know. Oh, what was that? So how can you actually make a vault 13? I mean, it's a, it's a bad luck number, isn't it? Okay, and there's another one down here. Kill it? No. Let's walk a little bit closer. And now. Yeah, there we go. So I guess we have all the rats here. Anything in these bones? Uh, a large pile of bleached animal bones. At least you think all the bones are animal. Okay. Uh, we are in, the, in a wasteland, nonetheless. 
Oh, there's there are a couple of another ones down here. Can we go through here? What's that? Is that a human? Hmm. Nothing. So let's go and kill these rats. Forty-nine percent. Not good enough. Oh, it's coming for us. And one more to go, I hope. There we go. We killed it. So any rats left? No, we killed all those. We killed all those. All those. So let's get out of this cave. Yeah, I don't know how long this game actually is. I think it's a lot shorter than the second one and the third. Um, my guess would be like 20 to 30 hours, which is okay. It's, oh, okay. To the west, you can see a natural light. For the first time in your life, you're looking at the outside world. Woohoo! What is that? You see bones. You think these might be honored kangaroo bones, but you cannot be sure. They are too weathered to make a final determination. Okay. So, um, I'm gonna end this. What the hell? I'm gonna end this part right here, and on the next part, we are not going to Vault 15 yet. Uh, we're gonna visit a town first, but we'll do that in the next part. So, thanks for watching. See you.